This episode of J. Baylot Tutorials is brought to you by Music Nations Network. Today on J. Baylot Tutorials, we take the moonwalk to Mars. Welcome to J. Baylock Tutorial, the show that gives you tips on dancing, job tips, and fitness. I'm your host, Jeff Baylock, and today here I got a special guest for you guys. Uh, we worked with this guy before, really good dancer in the game on YouTube. His channel will be in the description below. And without further ado, I'm going to give you to my special guest today. His name is Ricky Cespedes, and he's going to be teaching you all a new dance where he takes the moonwalk and totally blows it up. It's called the Mars Walk. Let's check it out. Hello everyone, it's Richard Cespedes, and I'm here working with Jeff Baylock again to teach you guys how to do the Mars Walk. Now, um, this is basically like a New Age Millennium Moonwalk, and uh, of course, uh, it's a real cool move, it's not that hard, it's very simple, but you just need to have balance. And uh, also, um, you have to purchase yourself some, the move requires penny loafers. You have to use penny loafers to do and execute the Mars walk. You have to use these penny loafers to perform the Mars walk um, because you're using your heel and toe to, to slide on. And uh, you have to use specific floors, but I'll be explaining that uh, later on. But without further ado, um, also this move is, um, was invented by me. I'm the original mentor of the Mars Walk, and uh, and without further ado, let's just get going to the tutorial. The first thing you want to do with the Mars Walk is you want to practice just kind of like standing, balancing yourself like this, and just kind of learning how to kind of shift the feet, you know, kind of balance and find your center of gravity. What you want to do is you want to have to kind of be as close and as lean down and be as center and balanced as you can. The Mars walk is different from the moon walk because you're gliding on your heel and toe in opposite directions. Like as you see, you're gliding on your heel and toe in opposite directions. Dance floor, can't be done at any floor. It has to be a specific dance floor nice smooth wood floors work best um it, it, it can't be on a normal um store shiny polished floor it can't be that way it has to be vinyl very smooth wood, wood or a dance floor it has to be it has to be a performance floor that's very smoothly lightable if you can do the moonwalk on it and, and other glides then you can do the mars walk on it most likely but vinyl works the best but what you're going to do is you're going to put Whatever foot you want to be in the heel, left or right, you start off in the position, the V position, just like the C walk. You start off in the V position, like this. And what you're going to do is you're going to do the same thing as you did with the stationary. Push your legs in opposite directions, the heel, whatever foot's on the toe, whatever foot's on the heel, you're going to push them in opposite directions of each other. Take your time and learn to balance. And you're going to um, have this foot be a little bit further back. It's going to be a little unorthodox. It's not going to be exactly like the stationary. It's going to be a little bit off. You're going to have this one further back. And what this is going to do... Music Nations Network is an entertainment network that helps your YouTube channel reach its next level. Many persons include high CPM rates, full YouTube partnership features, and a dedicated fan support team available seven days a week. It is free to join and all the requirements are simple. If you want to start getting your channel notice, log on to www.musicnationsnetwork.com. Music Nations Network for gaming and entertainment. And this one is going to help to bring you back. This foot on the toe, whatever foot is on the toe, this way or this way, this foot that's in the toe, you're gonna bring it back. Sorry, you're gonna bring it back and you're gonna pull yourself 
back, but at the same time, forward and at the same time also uh, going in opposite directions following the, the traditional Mars walk um, uh, pattern. Pull yourself back and you flatten the feet. You lift the feet again, you pull yourself again. A foot that's tipped. You want to have it as vertical as possible. Vertical. The more vertical the, the foot that's on its tiptoe, the more better the Mars walk dance will look. The more it'll look like you're walking, you're lifting to step. It's going to make you look like you're almost walking. It's going to give you that backwards, glide, slick, moonwalk type of look. That that is that is that was that's what defines the Mars walk. You want to make it less obvious that you're reaching back. You want to make it less obvious. This is where the technique starts to look better. The Mars walk dance looks better. You want to make it less obvious that you're reaching back. That you're reaching back and you're pulling yourself back. You want to make it seem as smooth and effortless as possible. You don't want to make it too wispy. You don't want to make it too... You're just kind of pulling around and just kind of looking weird and stuff, you know? Like, that's why the wide stride doesn't look good because it's too wispy. It doesn't have no structure to it. Make sure that this the tiptoe is sliding also. You see how that looks? They're both going opposite. Always make sure that they're going opposite. 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 Opposite directions. Don't do this. Don't do that. So, and again, this is Rich Assess it is. Thank you guys for watching. But thank you guys for watching on behalf of Dave Baylock and Rich Assess it is. This is the Mars Walk. Teach you guys how to do the Mars Walk. Remember, specific floors, dance floors, uh, smooth wood floors. Try to avoid acrylic floors because I tried acrylic floors, covered floors are kind of hard. Uh, vinyl floor coverings, the square ones you find a lot of those will work very well. Had no trouble with them. And uh, work the balance and get penny loafers. The smooth leather on heel and sole because it helps you to glide better. The leather helps you to glide better. The rich spit is. Working with Jay Freelock to teach you guys the Mars Walk. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to Ricky Sis videos or Jay Freelock's channel. Thank you and God bless. And to add on to what he was teaching to you guys, um, you want to make sure that you do have the balance and make sure that with this Mars Walk, you're actually making your feet move forward, where in the Moon Walk, you're moving backwards. You practice those things and you take it slowly, and I guarantee you'll learn this dance. I'm Jeff Baylock here with Jay Baylock Tutorials. Tune in next time to the next tutorial. And remember to always practice, practice, practice. Take care and be well.